What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dear the Savage, a.k.a. The Lord King. And today, guys, I'm bringing y'all a new series called... I don't know what it's called. I don't know what it's called yet. I'll, I'll probably find out when I'm putting it in the title. But today, guys, I'm going to show y'all how to play better defense. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to show y'all how to stop certain plays that are real effective this year. I'm going to show y'all how to stop certain routes that are effective this year. And that's basically the whole part of this new series that I'm dropping. So, first episode right here, guys, we're going to drop how to, how to stop corner strike. It's not necessarily just corner strike. It can be for any route that's in this play, guys. You know, last year when you watch Skimbo, Dubby, you know, I don't, Figgy, a lot of players that ran this play a lot, um, it was hard to stop because they were so one-dimensional on stopping two routes, which was the C route and the out route. All they wanted you to do is dink and dunk down the field, so you were either going to take the tight end flat or the running back flat. So I'm gonna show y'all how to stop this play, but also I'm gonna show y'all how to stop um the routes in this play. So what you wanna do, guys, is um you see the route. This is or you see the the defense. This is three four odd, and all I did was base line. I pinched my lineman and uh I crashed middle. I don't want. Why'd you drop so low? Okay. So anyways, this is how the play is gonna look. So this is the adjustments you're gonna make, guys. You're gonna put him in a hard flat. You're gonna man him up. You're gonna put him there, and you're gonna put him. And a, and a purple and so this guy right here you can move him or you can leave him it doesn't matter but what I like to do is put him right here so he can think he got the got the tight end and a streak but um this is the way the defense is gonna look you can also if you want guys you can put him in a flat you don't have to but I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you the way it stops the play and I'm gonna break it down to y'all so you see everything's guarded guys all you gotta do is guard the middle and click on and like I said guys this is the most simple way you can stop it um, base the line, pinch, slant inside, and spread your linebackers. The reason I spread them is just so if you have them this close, he might get picked up. So when you spread them, you know what I'm saying, he's actually to the outside. This guy you're going to put there. You're going to put him in a hard flat. You're going to move him. You're going to put him. His zone's going to be called inside third, guys. It's going to be the inside third because the inside half is like over here. But, um, yeah, you want to put him inside third or you know, we can go ahead and try, you know what I'm saying? We can put him in the outside, you know what I'm saying? We can try it if you want. But um, this is the way the play is going to look. Wait for Brady to say hut. You see the way my, my safety goes up to the top right. And right here, guys, you're going to click on. And you're going to play defense, you know what I'm saying? Basically, all you're going to do is click on. It's simple, guys. It's real simple. So I'm showing you all how to stop this play and stop the routes in this play. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually run another play in this um, same defense. But on offense, it's going to be corner strike. But I'm going to run it one more time. This is what the defense is going to look. You're taking away the outside, and all you're doing is controlling the middle, guys, which is going to be um, Amendola. You see Amendola right here. This is your guy right here. And right here, to click on to leave, you know what I'm saying, force a turnover, whatever the case may be. So that's simple. It's simple, guys. 3-4 odd, simple. So um, all you got to do is make adjustments. And um, we're going to run the same thing. 3-4 odd, cover 3 sky. That's the play. And um, we're going to, let me see, I'm going to look for, this is uncut, guys, so, you know what I'm saying, you're not going to see no editing in this, so y'all can, you know what I'm saying, see. Um, what's that one play that, uh, C routes, okay, I'm going to show you how to stop corner strike. This is not the real one, but, you know what, let me look for the real one, hold on, I'm not too sure, I don't want to make the video too long, that's why. Is it out of this play? Or formation? Hold on. Guys, what you can do is skip this part because I'm just looking for the play I can't really find it I'm not I don't remember what see Patriots book is different like I don't remember what thing it's out of um wow um it doesn't matter I'll just I'll just run this corner strike or hold on um all right it doesn't matter um I'm gonna run this corner strike right here guys I'm gonna run this corner strike so basically the objective is Take out the C routes. Nothing out the middle. Just take out the C routes. So what we're going to do is baseline, pinch, slant, and spread your linebackers. You're going to put these guys in hard flats. Or no, we're going to put them in purple. So we're going to put them in purples. We're going to put both our, um, both our, uh, what you going to call it? Both our players, our corners in cloud flats. And we're going to shape the outside, guys. We're going to shape the outside. And this is the way the play should look. Um, all you're really going to guard is right here. See? 
There's nothing open. Oh wow. Okay, right there he just he just beat us because of the speed, obviously. You know what I'm saying? Beat us because of his speed. But in Mutt, you know what I'm saying? You play Mutt draft champions or whatever it is. Um, that's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Trust me. So with like I said, guys, you're gonna shade outside and right here, guys, you can actually shade the the deep half of the field. So it's, since you know it's gonna be C routes, because every time he's run, that person or whatever the case may be might be running C routes, you're gonna guard the outside, like I said. So um, let's see. This is all it is, guys. This is all it is. And right there, Chris Harris. Nope, Chris Harris didn't get there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so we're gonna try something else, since Brandon Cooks is just that fast, I guess. So we're gonna put them there, and we're gonna move him. So we're just gonna leave him. We're gonna leave him up there. Oh, what we can do also, guys, we can actually man him up. We can man him up. We're gonna shape the outside. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna shape the outside. And this is really, guys. This is just the basics, guys. Honestly, it's just the basics. You see the way I took that away. My um, my purple was playing the purple, and um, this is just the basic way. No blitzes, you know what I'm saying? Oh crap! No, no one's getting blitz. Um, so sometimes you might have to hope that the guy makes a bad read for that one thing. So we're gonna actually put our middle linebacker in a purple to help the outside. And um, you see right there. So like I said, deep half of the field, guys. This is way another way that you can stop it. And um, after this, guys, I'm gonna show y'all how to stop the plays with um, a blitz that I have on my channel. And you see right there, guys. He's pretty much boxed. I know the check down was there, but I would have made a different adjustment. I didn't need to follow the C route. But he was pretty much boxed. So what I'm gonna show y'all right here is a blitz that y'all can run. I do have this blitz on my channel. All you gotta do is find is two foot five even. Um, I'm not too sure who's fast on the team, but what you're gonna do, you're gonna overload three, and um, I don't. It doesn't really matter who's on here. So we're gonna call overload three, and we're gonna go to corner strike. All right, we're gonna go to corner strike out of gun bunch, and we're gonna stop it. So we're gonna set up corn. We're gonna set up the blitz. Y'all know how to set up the blitz if y'all seen the video. And now that we got two people like that, guys, this is. Oh, I think I contain. You're not supposed to contain. But um, we're gonna put a heart. We're gonna put a a purple right there, and that's it. This is where the, the blitz is, the setup is gonna look, guys. So um, basically the reason this is the way it looks, the C route, the C route. Actually, with a C route, guys, you can man up that that C route to the left side. So this guy is really gonna guard both the running back and that C route. You are gonna guard. You can guard Gronk. No, not Gronk. You're going to guard Amendola. So what you're going to do, you're going to guard Amendola. This this uh, cloud flat right here is going to guard both the corner route and Gronk. So this guy is going to help. And all you got to do is guard Amendola. So I'm going to show you all right here. That's all you, that's all you got to do. Guard Amendola. But yes, they're going to make that quick read. But most of the time in Mutt, you know what I'm saying, your players um, won't do that. But, oh, crap. So I'm gonna set it up with a hard flat out there instead, so y'all can believe me. Um, and this blitz, I know what y'all are thinking. Well, what, well, Jay, what if you know what I'm saying? What if the blitz, or oh, not the blitz? What if he throws the ball too fast, or what if he makes a read too fast? Listen, this blitz gets in a lot, guys. I've sh I showed y'all a lot of gameplay of it coming in, and you see it right there. Um, at most, this this guy might pick up two to three yards every time at most. So um, the blitz actually does get in, guys. And if anything, you know, they might or they will have to block a running back or a tight end. So really, guys, all you have to worry about is Amdola and Hogan. Sometimes you don't even got to worry about Gronk or Lewis, you know what I'm saying? So one last time, guys, this is, the way, this is the way it's set up. And let me show you. So once again, all you got to do is guard Amendola, guys. But just focus on Amendola. Um... I actually got to focus on. See, like I said, guys, it forces a quick read every time. But um, I hope y'all enjoy this video, guys, how to stop corner strikes, C routes, and post outs, or if you want to call them out routes, whatever. Um, I'm going to run it one more time. But if y'all want to see more tutorial videos like this, how to get better playing defense, let me know in the comment section because I will drop a lot more. Let me know what y'all have trouble against, and I'll show y'all how to stop it, whether it's a run, whether it's a certain play, the pass, um, what defense to run. Just a lot of stuff, guys, and I'm the plug for it, man. Trust me. But, um, yeah, it's your boy, Jay the Savage, a.k.a. the Lurk King. And...
like I said, guys, one more time, I'm going to put it right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to put it right here. Let me know if y'all need help base aligning and, you know, knowing how to show blitz, how to base align, show blitz, crash align a certain way, contain, whatever it is, guys. Just let me know and I will put it out. But um, I'll wrap up the video right here, guys. It's your boy, Jada Savage, a.k.a. The Lord King. And I hope you all enjoyed this video, man. Make sure if you did, make sure you drop a like. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you drop a subscribe button. And I'm signing out, man. It's grind season. Let's get it.